Hello, you're on a SetaNet channel. In this review, I will show you how to set a proxy if you are working with the Memo emulator. For those who do not know, Memo is an Android emulator that you can install on your computer and do the same actions as if you were working from smartphone with Android. There is no way to set a proxy directly in the emulator. I will show you two options how to do this. The first option – using the Proxifier program, which will allow you to proxify only the Memo emulator, and all further actions in the emulator will be through the specified proxy. In the second method, I will install the proxy Droid application from the Google Market in the emulator, which will allow you to do all actions on the network directly from the emulator when using a proxy. I will start with the first method. Launch Proxifier and select the Profile step, then Proxy Server. In the window that opens, select Add and then specify your proxy data. In the Address and Port fields, specify the IP and port, respectively. In the Protocol section, select the protocol type. If you have a free proxy, nothing else is needed, and if it is a personal proxy, then make Authentication active and enter the proxy login and password in the fields below. When you have entered it, check the proxy for operability by clicking Check. If the message is displayed in green, then the proxy is working and you can use it, and if it is red, then you need to specify another proxy. When you have entered everything, click OK and Yes in the window that opens. Now select the Profile step again and then Proxification rules. Below select Add to add a rule. In the window that opens, specify the rule name and in the application section, select the Memo Emulator file with the EXE extension on your computer. In the Action field, select the previously specified proxy. Click OK. Then you can launch the emulator and all work with it will be through the proxy. The second way to use a proxy when working with a Memo emulator is with the Proxy Droid application. Download it from the Google Market and run it. Scroll down to the Address section. Click on it. In the window that opens, enter the proxy IP. Click on port below and also in the window that opens, enter the proxy port. Below in the proxy server type section, select the protocol type. If you have a personal proxy, not a free one, scroll down to make enable authentication active. The fields for entering the login and password become active. Click on user and enter the login of your proxy. Then click on password and enter the password of your proxy. When everything is set, scroll to the very top and enable the use of the proxy. This completes the setup and now you can safely and anonymously work on the network through the Memo emulator. If you have any questions, write them in the comments. Click like, subscribe to the channel and good luck!